be short, maybe a short uh, response. Uh, basically, I think education is very important, but at the same time, to be realistic about it, and and we are really talking about the system change in a sense, as a, as a Paul mentioned, is that education is it's not going to work overnight. I mean, it, you we have to actually uh, come up with an a good narrative about our country. And I think a big part of it, and I, that's why, for instance, I would appreciate, I appreciated Paul's uh, uh, input, is that we need to learn from others, from other countries as well. Because our tendency right now is to really look at the Philippines and say what's not working for us, right? Including the state, including the role of government. We need to be able to hold government accountable. And it's the only way that we will take elections seriously. But every time, if we are provided a counter argument that government should stay out of our business, of our lives, of our economy, then we are in fact defeating that main premise, which is government should be accountable to us as taxpayers. So I think in a way, it is a paradigm shift that is required. And uh, again, this is not going to be easy, but at the same time, I think it really has to be started. Comparative analysis, comparative studies is one thing. Historical analysis, going back and, and in fact, interrogating how our history has been, uh, going back and seeing how we can deconstruct our history so that in the fact, you know, things that we have learned uh, about ourselves, we need to subject under real rigorous uh, study.